What's good, YouTube? You already know it is your boy and dog. Come to get you another video. And before we start this video, man, make sure you hit that like button. Also, subscribe if you're new. Make sure you guys are following my homie Sins World, you know what I'm saying? And your yeah, Instagram and everything like that to be in the description. So, what's good with y'all, man? Hope you guys are having a great day. You know, our praise is due to the most high. This is the Sabbath day, man. We got to make sure we keep it holy the best way we can. You know, so all praise due to the most high. So listen, today we're going to be talking about how women make it easy for you when you are handsome. Now listen, it's not enough talk about this, man. A lot of people y'all watch on these YouTube videos, man, they tend to gain success with women. And, you know, women begin to make things a little bit easier for them when they obtain some type of superficial thing, whether it be, you know, success, status, whatever. And, um... It's men out here, you know, that are just good looking, very handsome, you know, very attractive to women. And they are getting the same treatment and they don't even have the status or money. So you guys need to be aware of that because most cases, man, you're going to you're going to know or ever heard of a man who's, you know, was very attractive. And he just had a lot of women who was receptive towards him, you know, who wasn't playing no games with me and thing like that, man. And it is possible out here. It's very unheard of in this space, man, that, you know, women can actually act that way towards a man just based off his looks. You know, a lot of people tend to brainwash, you know, a lot of men out here and have men thinking it's all this other stuff. I got to get all this extra stuff, you know, to make women just truly cooperate with me when it is that is completely false. You know, it's completely bullshit because women, when they find you very attractive, and they are really feeling you and you really turn them on they are not going to make things complicated for you they will want to do things right away with you man but let's hop straight into it so number one they will gaze at you now it's the difference between a stare see i'm looking at you now i'm just staring at you but it's a difference when a woman is gazing at you, she's gonna be see what i'm saying like it's a different look in your eyes you know it's a eye it's a eye contact that lets you know there there is something there you know because a woman is gazing at you, you know, she's gazing, you know, when you go outside and you're looking at the sun, you know, you are gazing, you are gazing, you are trying to absorb that, man, a woman is trying to look at you and she's really feeling you at that moment, so she has no choice but to gaze, you are putting her in, you know, almost a trance, man, because depending on what level you are, you know, a lot of times women just can't hide it when they are in a trance, man. I don't know how many times I done had an instance where, you know, a woman was just in a trance. My phone ringing everything, man. I'm put it on vibrate real quick. But I don't know how many instances where I had where a woman was just in a trance. You know, we were staring, making eye-to-eye -eye contact, and I could just feel it, man. You know, we're going to get, I ain't going to lie, I'm going to tell y'all about, I'm going I'm to get into a video about, you know, feeling the sexual energy. But the woman was just in a gaze, man. Like, they're going to be in a gaze over you because I'm telling you guys, they can't hide. The fact that you are very attractive to them they can't hide that man so they are going to gaze from afar right in your face out of eye contact whatever they're going to do that because you are turning them on man you haven't even said a word to them and you are already turning them on just by your looks man so be aware of that man they will gaze at you number two they will flirt with you now women a lot of people say oh women don't come up oh women don't do this women don't approach i'm gonna let y'all know right now again that's bullshit women will come up and flirt with you if you look good enough if you don't look good enough they're not gonna do it or i'm gonna tell you this man if you got you know what i'm saying a high a high level of status then of course they will but for the majority of the time man if you ain't got a high level of status or if you don't look very very attractive then you're gonna have to work a little bit harder let's just be honest man you know, I'm just going to keep it real. I'm 5'10". It's people out there. It's men out there that are 6'8". They're going to have to work easier, and I'm going to have to work harder to get certain women. It's just what it is, man. We're not going to sit here and cry about this shit. So, listen, they will flirt with you, man. They will come up to you, you know, just say stupid stuff. You know, just just nothing, man. Just trying to flirt with you all the time. I didn't have one woman at work come up to me and tell me, we should switch jobs for a second. I just sit there, and I said, what? She looked at me and said, hey, we should switch jobs. I want your job. And I think about it. A normal man would be like, oh, that's nothing. She's just being friendly. No, 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 no. She wants stuff to escalate. It's just the bottom line. She wants it to escalate. You know what I'm saying? And 
Yeah, women will do that, man. Women will come up to you and just flirt with you, man. Like, I'm going to tell you this right now, guys. Whenever a woman is just trying to have a stupid conversation with you, and it literally means nothing, she's flirting with you and hoping you'll escalate it. As a man, you are supposed to escalate it. She don't, she don't have to escalate everything for you. You know, you got to be a man in a situation or else she's going to take the masculine role. So you have to escalate that, man, when women are softly flirting with you, man. They, they are going to softly flirt start up a conversation etc so when you you know what i'm saying you recognize that hey you better get a number or something but yeah number three they openly make sexual comments about you now listen pretty simple man i noticed a lot of this when i was working man when you are in the workforce and you are at a level three well i think that yeah i did make a level three man i'm just say the highest level when you are a highest level handsome man let me tell you right now in the workforce, women are going to be throwing themselves at you. Women are going to be making all types of comments towards you, man. I'm telling you this right now. Women are not going to be afraid. There isn't going to be a boundary of them being openly sexual with you, of them letting you know, you know, anything about sex. They're not going to be, you know what I'm saying, having a boundary up about it. Not for the average men, they might, but with you since you already turning them on they're gonna let you know straight up what it is and what it ain't so women will make openly sexual comments towards you in public at the workforce wherever they will do it listen guys i done had one instance where i knew this woman liked me i knew she liked me but i was never giving her the time of the day i was never giving her the time of the day now keep in mind this woman is probably early 30s no kids she's fine you know she's brown skin cute ass eyes and she thick and so keep this in mind, man. I'm, I'm maybe I'm about 21 at the time. I'm about 21. So yeah, I'm at I'm at work and stuff like that. And um, I've been noticed she liked me. You know what I'm saying? She been through me a few choosing and signals. But this is where I knew, like, okay, this woman, this woman actually wants it. She wants it bad. So check this out, man. This woman was bent over, and I had to walk past her to get whatever I was about to do. Whatever I was about to do, I had to get past her. So I was like, excuse me. She was bent over, ass up. This is exactly what she looked. This is exactly what she turned around, looked at me, and said, You know, it's hard for an old woman to get out this position. Now, see, some of y'all might say, Oh, she just wanted attention. No, she ain't want attention. She wanted me because this woman showed me clear, clear signs that she wanted me to escalate things plenty of times. But they will be openly sexual, which you see how she said that, right in my face, right while other people were around. You know it's hard for an old woman to get out of this position. What else is she saying that for? I'm telling you guys, man, they will be openly sexual with you when you are a handsome man because you are good looking. Women can't hide their antics when you are good looking. When they know they are suck because i'm gonna tell y'all this right now man a lot of women are sucker for good looks don't get it twisted a lot of young women man and even older women they sucker for good looks do not get it twisted man don't get it twisted and i'm a, I'm a matter of fact guys let me let me do this real quick let me go back to number one real quick when i said about the uh about the gays and this is towards older women now i was at a dollar store man and soon as i was coming in the store it was she probably about 35, 40. But she, you know, she had a like nice little body on her. This woman was walking out the store. She was walking towards her car. She stopped, slowed down, and kind of got herself ready to be approached right while I was coming in. It happens, guys. It happens. But just have to add that up in there. Number four, sex is thrown at you. Listen, I have to talk to women and get women to tell me what's inside of them first before I stick my wood in them. Because... I want to establish a covenant with a woman before I stick my wood in a man. Because you got to think about some guys. You got to make that woman. You got to make that woman give you ownership over her before you stick your wood in her. You just have to. It's the bottom line. It's how God would want it to be, man. We don't need to be just sticking our wood in anything, bro, and just going crazy. We need to make these women establish a covenant with us. Because if not, we're going to be looking stupid. You know what I'm saying? You want to make a woman earn that sex. Because think about this, guys. This is me. Some of y'all don't retain, but I know a lot of y'all boys do. I'm retaining all this energy, man. I'm retaining all this energy, man. When you have sex with a woman, you are going to have to deliver. 
you know she might ride you or whatever you know give you a blowjob but for the most part you're gonna have to put in your dominance you're gonna have to do that so why not make this woman earn it if she don't want to stay around enough to earn it okay she can take her ass on but it's what i'm saying you got to make a woman earn that man because women gonna be throwing sex at you they're gonna be throwing their pussy at you all day you know what i'm saying they're gonna be throwing it at you you know and you can't sit here and fold to that man you got to make them earn something you got to make them invest something make them invest something man because i'm telling you right now in sex let's be real man a woman can be freaky on you and do all that but i'm telling you right now a man is doing 90 percent of the work because he gonna have to he gonna have to lay down that i'm telling you guys you gonna have to lay down the wood regardless of what she do there's only a few positions in which she's doing the most work whether she's riding you giving you a blowjob something like that you know or reverse cowgirl but if she do that man you know she for the streets but the point is, if she, she can only do three things that she's going to have to put all her energy into. The rest of them, you are going to have to put in all the work from the back, from the front, from the side. You're going to have to put in all the work, all that choking, talking to it. That's all your work. So make her earn it, man. Make her earn it because me, she's going to have to earn something. She's not going to sit here and get this wood that we just met. No. No. I'm not just any ordinary dude, man. I'm not no mini man. You finna work for this, but yes. Women will throw sex at you, man. Let me tell you this right now. And this is just me keeping it a buck with you. Listen, guys. This is just me keeping it a buck. I'm at a development stage in my life. And um, I, I live with my mom. I have no shame. But the thing is, my mom is cool, you know. I can bring I can bring a girl in if I want to, you feel me? But listen, check this out. I just had to let y'all know that. Now, listen. This is what I mean by sex is thrown at you. So, it was a girl at work. Keep this in mind. Every dude wanted to hit her. Every time I come up, this is how you know in this bag, guys. I literally see dudes trying to talk to her. Literally see supervisors trying to holler at her. I'm just watching it. Meanwhile, she's showing all that attention to me. Just throwing attention to me. Just coming to me. Just study choosing on me. And you know what I do? I get her number. And guess what she comes? This is what I tell you. This is what I tell her. She asks me, you know what I'm saying? Do I have a crib or whatever? So I let her know off top, you know. I don't got my own crib, but I got a I got a spot with privacy. And I'm like, is that a problem? Because if it is a problem, you know what I'm saying? Goodbye. Because I know some girl gonna come over here and that's gonna chill with me and whatever. But she's like, no, nah, that ain't no problem. Guess she did. She pulled up over here at my mama crib, went in and we did what we had to do. This is just me letting you guys know this, man. Like, you don't even have to have your own crib. Now, I don't recommend not having your own crib, but you get what I'm saying, man. I'm just saying it's like, Handsome men can can really do a lot of things. They can break a lot of rules. I'm telling you this, man. Women are not going to hold you to this superficial standard. I'm telling you that right now, man. As long as you don't talk your way out of it and don't bring yourself down on the scale, hey, man, women going to be all for you. They're going to they gonna be throwing the pussy at you, man. It's just the bottom line. I just got to be honest with you guys. I'm not saying go out here and be a slip with this handsome man stuff, but I'm just telling you, man, this stuff is going to happen. Just the bottom line, man. It is what it is, you know. They're going to throw sex at you, you know, and stuff like that. But yeah, number five, they invest time and energy early. So yeah, women, they're, they're going to invest in you, man, very early. When you are in the beginning stages of talking to them, they're going to invest their time, their energy, man. They're going to be trying to spend as much time with you as possible. They're trying to, they're going to be trying to get to know you. They're going to do whatever it takes, man. What I always do with a woman, man, whenever she's coming up, I always let her know, you know what I'm saying? Bring a bottle of Hennessy or something, bring a bottle of wine, bring some weed, whatever, because make her invest, man. You got to make her spend the money in some. Because these women got it too easy out here, man. They got it too easy. They got it with dudes who don't value themselves. So make sure you are doing it, man. Because being handsome, man, you got to keep yourself up. This is not something that we just... Now, okay, of course, man, we wake up and we look good. But I'm talking about to the, to the point where it's just, you know, you got them chasing you. But we keep ourselves up, man. This is a job, you know. We do this. So make her invest something, man. Make her invest something. She's going to give you a full 100% time and energy. She's going to do that, you know, because she see physically, man, you are just, you know, and I'm telling you guys, the way you don't talk yourself out of it, just remain calm, have a quiet masculine frame and just, you know, talk normal. Don't be no weirdo, man. That's just the bottom line. But yeah, women make it easier for you when you are a handsome man. They do. I'm just telling you this, guys. And, you know, plenty of handsome men in the comments are going to agree with me because it's the truth.
you know but yeah if you guys enjoyed the video make sure you hit the like button also subscribe if you're new comment down below to know anything about this topic and i'm out y'all peace